Hey guys, it's Glenn from Glenn'sCarCollection.com, and could this be the ultimate winter beater? An E46 M3 wagon with all-wheel drive? Hmm, with that S54 engine? Now, before you say there's no such thing as an E46 M3 wagon, you're right, but I'm gonna tell you how this came to be in a minute. So remember to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss our next video. And watch this video all the way through. I'll tell you the price of this resto mod, and you tell me whether you would buy this or if you would use that money for something else. So what gave me the idea is we posted the uh, E39 540 wagon that was converted into M5 specs with the engine, running gear, uh, differential wheels that just sold on Bring a Trailer for big money, 72000 Once you pay Bring a Trailer's 5% buyer's premium and sales tax in your home state, you're probably into it about 80000 So is there a $20,000 version out there that could be very attractive? Maybe not with the uh, E39 S62 motor, but with an S54 or even the V8 from the E92 M3. Well, I found this on uh, Denver, Colorado Craigslist and I thought this would make the ultimate winter beater. If I was gonna add a winter beater, I would seriously consider this car. Now, basically it started out life as a 2001 325 XI sport wagon. It has a manual transmission. It has an orient blue metallic exterior, exterior, which I think is a great color. It has a lot of miles, 280,000 miles are estimated on the chassis, so nobody even knows for sure it could be more than that. But most importantly, it has this the S54 engine from a 2004 E46 M3. Now that motor has 88,000 miles, but it has been uh, pretty much rebuilt. It's a six speed manual transmission, which is the most important part. Rebuild heads, vanos, uh, new rod bearings, et cetera, et cetera. And this could be the ultimate, basically winter beater, just fun knock around car. Now the asking price is 22,800. I know nothing about the car condition. I'll leave a link in the Craigslist ad if it's still available by the time this video posts and you go do a PPI yourself, but I thought this could be fun. So that kind of begs the question, would you buy this for $22,000? I'm sure the guy's negotiable. Or would you use that money to get the real thing like a used E46? Obviously, uh, a regular E46 M3 would be rear drive, which of course is more fun. And that's why I kind of said this is a winter beater. Uh, nothing sounds like the S54 engine. The only thing that sounds better than the S54 engine is this, a uh, wagon with an engine swap of the S65 engine from the V8 M3. So this is the four liter V8 found in the E92 M3. And this would really make the ultimate uh, wagon or, or winter daily. This car was actually on Bring a Trailer that you're seeing now and sold for $42,000. Again, you add the 5% buyer's premium, another two grand or so tax in your home state and you're probably into it in the upper 40s. But that would be the ultimate, but that's that's still kind of pricey. You could get a nice E92 M3 for 40 grand for sure. So I think I would come back to this car. I think having the S54 in a three series wagon would be a blast to drive. I think it's worth every penny if you can score this car in the low 20s. It does have a lot of miles on it, so of course check it out. But uh, hey, you got a red line of 8,000 RPM in your wagon and all wheel drive, so you can drive it all year round. It's got enough miles on it that it certainly won't be collectible. If you try to do this yourself, it would cost way more money. So I think it could be a good buy for someone, assuming the car checks out. And I'm just saying this is an interesting car, not that it checks out or that you should buy it. So what do you guys think? Leave a comment below. Would you buy this car for 20 grand? Or would you just buy an E46 M3? Or would you rather just have a three series wagon because you get the all wheel drive? Let me know in the comments below, but I think this is a real cool car. I wish this was in New Jersey so I can review it. Thanks again for watching guys. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss the next video. And I will see you next time. Leave your comments below and I will read each and every one of them. Take care.